Hey guys, welcome back. I have an unboxing for you guys for Color Rush Studio. I just got this kit in and I cannot wait to get into it. I mean, I'm, I'm looking at the color palette and I'm getting the feels as we speak. So let's make sure that we can see enough of these treasures. Oh, I can't wait to see what's in here. Okay. Okay. Try not to peek too much because I want to, you know, share it with you as we go. So let's jump right into it. So I see a bunch of simple vintage love story. <gasps> it's so pretty. Okay. Let's just one by one. This piece is called Our Story. So we've got this gorgeous aqua background. We have got kind of this wine color. We've got a little bit of yellow in there. Uh, Multi-tonals of the pinky mauvey goodness. Let's see, I was trying to see, cause I don't know like if these repeat or if they're all different. Cause I could show you both sides if they repeat, but I have no idea. I have no idea. We're gonna find out, hold on. I'm trying to figure it out. Chances are I'll start, okay, whatever. We're just gonna flip it. Oh, the backside is so pretty. So we've got a stack of books and some eyeglasses and some butterflies going up. That's pretty, especially if you like to document your reading. This one is called four by four elements. I'm assuming there's four by four elements on the backside. We've got all kinds of tickets. They are gorgeous and they're all stacked on top of one another. And then we've got the four by four elements. And these kind of things I love because I love fussy cutting out the different pieces and using them as ephemera, super gorgeous. And I know what I'll be spending my entire day doing. Got it. I'm gonna cut all of these creatures out. I love them. You've got this watercolor soft vibe that is just stunning. Neutral background, look at the orchid. I mean, do you guys see that orchid tone with the aqua? Oh my gosh, I, I cannot wait. I better have some pictures that look good with this because I need to craft right away. Now the flip side to this one is this gorgeous aqua piece with the polka dots. So I'm so glad we got two of these because I wanna use this as a background. This on top is gonna be great. We have two of this one. This one's called Forever and Always. So we've got a nice dark, dark background. And then we've got the florals with these gorgeous, gorgeous birds. And I love birds. Oh. I mean, look at the artwork on this birdie. So cute. And the flip side to that one is this piece right here. Oh, another piece that is perfect for a background. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, Charla. I appreciate you knowing what I am needing for this. Oh my goodness. Okay, oh, sorry, I'm moving the pieces because my computer's kind of freaking out right now. Okay, so next. Oh, another perfect background, same kind of a vibe on the background, like, like the flourishy wallpaper vibe. So pretty. All right. Oh, and we have two of this one. So we've got this really nice, it's almost going into a rosy with mulberry. And the flip side of that is this here. So we've got a pattern pinky background. Do you see we have that same kind of pattern that you find here? But then you have all of these hearts and they're like layered up like vintage papers for the hearts. And you guys, if you're needing like another little embellishment, you have a scrap, don't throw these away. Look at how cute those would be to cut out. Oh my gosh. And like put epoxy stuff on top. Okay. I have plans. Plans are happening. The next piece we have, and we have two of these, is this one's called Love Notes. I haven't even been telling you. This is my heart. This is forever and always. This is ever after. <laughs> and that is two by two, four by four elements. Okay. So this is called love notes. So we've got gorgeous, gorgeous stamps. Each and every one of these pieces is an amazing embellishment. So beautiful. Love, love, love. And then we've got old school type keys. I mean, come on. And you're getting the vibe, like there's a shiny metallic kind of thing on there. So they did great artwork with that. Love that. And if you really wanted to, you could do your title. You know, find the different letters that are on there and do the title. This one is called Journal Elements. So this, is this the same as this? Nope. 
so this one's different, but it's got the same like color vibe going on. So we have journal elements. We've got this gorgeous floral on a nice dark background, but then you've got all of these pieces and they're in different sizes. Clearly that's a gorgeous piece to fussy cut. So is this, but you also have your gorgeous little pieces of artwork. I would love to cut that out. Oh, I'm gonna be cutting out all the things. That's what I'm gonna to do today is cut out all of the things. And our last pattern paper, this is called tag elements. So we've got all kinds of tags, tags with tags with tags. Look, there's this one looks like an Instax camera. We've got this gorgeous ink pen. Oh, that's one of those little wax stamper things. I want one of those. I so want one of those with like all kinds of punchy things. I should tell my kids for Christmas. I want one of those. Okay. <laughs> Um, together is a beautiful place to be. We've got our stamps. There's our little type keys again. Butterflies. Love it. And then the backside are a lot calmer. So you can do all kinds of journaling and all that kind of thing with the backside. All right, let's get out the embellishment. All right, so let's see what our alpha is because that's always my next exciting thing to look at. Oh, it's a nice one. Okay. It's evergreen and holly. So they're foil chipboard letter stickers. So really nice white core, great size. It can, you know, it's like, it's not too big, not too small. It's just right. Little bit of numerics, a little bit of punctuation. I love the gold foiling with this gorgeous kind of romantic key, pretty kind of a kit. Now, let's see, for our frazzles and ribbons, oh, we've got this gorgeous pom-pom trim, love pom-pom. And then we've got this white with the leafy bits, a white with black polka dots and a stripey kind of trim. And I like, I like that the frazzle and ribbons comes with like, they're a little scuffy scuff. I think it's more interesting. All right, so we've got for bits and pieces, we've got some cork pieces, which is really kind of cool. This club gives us some of the most interesting bits. And this is on sticker paper, guys or it's sticker goo on the back. And it's it's like it's like burnished or something. Hello, gorgeous. We have got, hello, look at the little hello heart. Cute. Love, a, hello, love, that would be cute. Like, hello, love. And then this piece here has all these crisscrosses. I don't I wanna make sure you can see how cute. Reminds me of a waffle, but then again, I'm hungry. Oh, we've got metal keys. And guys, this packaging right here can totally be used, this little craft packaging. So we've got all of these great keys. Look at this one reminds me of like a king. And then is that one does too. What's going on here? The association game is strong today. So we've got these metallic cool keys. I mean, they're metal. Very cool. Ooh, we've got fabric-y hearts. So they, they squishy. Guys, have you seen these? Let me get one of them out. So what do we have? One, two, three, four, five. And I love using these. Let me grab this little heart out. So they're dimensional, right? But they totally squish down. So you're not going to have a problem putting them into your pages if you're worried about bulk. Although I am not at all. But very squishy, very sweet. And they have that corduroy vibe. Love that. Then we've got a goodie package that we have to look through. Goodie package, goodie package. You know what, guys? Let me get a bin out because I'm going to be crafting with this in like two seconds. <sighs> I had all these little paper fibers in there. Okay, so we've got goodies. Clearly, we have doilies. All right, let's start. Look at these. All right, they're like little sticker gems. And you're getting like a holographic vibe off of them. Nice amount. Great. Itty bitty cute doilies, and then we have medium sized doilies. And then we've got, oh, that's very cool. We've got a piece of a burlap. Very cool. Then the last thing that we have, least, not least, last, least, we have the Simple Stories floral bits from this collection. I feel like we got spoiled this month. Now, I do know that she had some add on kits as well as a collection pack but I don't know if they're already sold out because they're so darned pretty that I can see them just go so quickly. All right, I'm gonna go like this for now so we can see them just a little better on the white. We've got a couple of little hearts, which are great 
to, you know, pop around your clusters. So these are all florals. So I don't have to keep saying florals. Some are larger, some are smaller. Love this golden pop of yellow in here. Oh, guys, I will have links down below where you can get your hands on these kits, of course, because they're so darned pretty. And the design team posts on the main page in, um, I'm not, not in, on Facebook. Oh, we've got a little golden yellow butterfly buggy bit. Oh, a taller piece. So darned pretty. So you guys can layer up just so beautifully. These would be gorgeous on cards too. Look at the little buggy. So we've got some butterflies in here. We've got some hearts along with a couple of the leafy bits and of course all the florals. So pretty. I cannot wait. I'm going to be putting some Nouveau glaze on it. I'm going to be jazzing them up and bending them and doing dimensional everything. And I cannot literally wait to create. So lots and lots of hearts in all of the colors in the collection, which I think is fabulous. So it's like you could use this for Valentine's, but it does not have to be Valentine's. This would actually be gorgeous for my daughter's wedding dress photos, but I'm not willing to put or do layouts with them yet until her uh, fiance sees the dress because, you know, we want all the luck that we have available to us. Love this deep, deep wine color. Your little buggy coming in this way. More hearts, a nice single leaf. Look at the color of this one. Oh, it's almost the color of my shirt. Who knew, who knew? Stunning collection, I, I just can't. I can't wait to see what she has in store for us. She is an incredibly, incredibly hardworking small business owner. And I love what she comes up with. All right, so we've got a couple buggies in the same color palette. Ooh, and then this is a super, oh, one more little heart in a mulberry color, and then a really large floral cluster. So that's what I have for you guys today. I cannot wait to get creating with all of these treasures. I'll have links down below, and I'll see you guys ever so soon with another video. Bye for now, friends.